uh, Monsieur Barnier said earlier that there were key areas upon which he wasn't prepared to make many concessions. Well, you didn't need to, sir, because you were up against Theresa May, and she was... <laughs> And she was all for making as many concessions as she possibly could, including agreeing a ludicrous bill of up to 40 billion sterling for us to have the right to leave, a continued role for the European Court of Justice, and uh, in line with that, uh, family reunions uh, that mean, frankly, open door immigration from the European Union is going to continue for years to come, and almost bizarrely, a commitment for ongoing regulatory alignment. It's as if, even though we're leaving, effectively the British government wants to keep us in some form of single market relationship. So I'm not surprised uh, you're all very pleased with her. Theresa the appeaser has given in on virtually everything. <laughs>